Tonight, Mayor Lori Lightfoot is sounding the alarm. COVID cases are soaring for young black Chicagoans and vaccine rates are low in African-American neighborhoods. Our Jim Williams tells us how the mayor is trying to change those trends. Mayor Lightfoot is getting help from black churches and black leaders to take on the persistent vaccine reluctance among some African-Americans. The St. John Missionary Baptist Church in Roseland opened its doors today for the second dose of the Pfizer COVID vaccine. It's very important for the church to do this because this is in the community of Roseland and the people in the Roseland community need to have access to the vaccine. Church Administrator Eva Green says more than 120 people will receive the doses here administered by the new Roseland Community Hospital. That the shots are given here at the church, Green tells us, creates trust in this black neighborhood. It's very important that the churches be involved with these efforts because that lets the community know that as black people, we are all in this together. The vaccine is safe and it's safe for you and safe for others in your household. In bringing attention to the mass vaccination site at Chicago State University, Mayor Lightfoot sounded the alarm. While half of Chicago's residents have received at least one dose of the vaccine, Lightfoot says the number is much lower in South Side black neighborhoods, 12 to 19%. In the black community, the COVID positivity rate is 7.9%, more than two points higher than the rest of Chicago. The sharpest increase, the mayor says, is among African Americans 18 to 44. We should not have people continue to die in Chicago from this virus when we have the life-saving vaccine that is free and readily available. The new Roseland Community Hospital has mobile units vaccinating Southsiders and has an ally in the St. John Missionary Baptist Church. The more that we are vaccinated, the better we, we will be and we all be able to get out and fellowship and entertain with each other. The mayor said black Chicagoans are getting sick and dying more than other groups. By appearing at the mass vaccination site at Chicago State University, she is trying to convince the city that the vaccine is available. Jim Williams, CBS 2 News.